Today we're looking at the Stella Artois. I think that's how to pronounce it. Um, this is a Belgium beer and I got this for $14.90 for four bottles. So it's about $3.75 each, somewhere there. And that's a pretty good deal, right? Because I just had the uh, IKEA Lager Beer at $3.90. So this is actually uh, more famous, but at a lower price. So fun fact about the Stella is that it's also known as the Wife Beater. Now, I'm not too sure of the origins of the story, um, but one of, the, the, one of my UK friends actually shared with me that uh, this was the first 5% beer 5% uh, alcohol beer that was served in pubs, uh, maybe in the 70s compared to the usual 3% beers uh, they have on tap and because of that a lot of guys got drunk uh, they went home and you know were a bit violent uh, towards their wives um, when they were necked at. This then became known as the wife beater. Okay, so let's see how this compares with the IKEA beer I had earlier. Uh, again, you know, ensure that when you pour, a lot of foam comes up so that you don't have that foam in your stomach. It actually looks a lot lighter in terms of color. So compared to the IKEA beer I had earlier, this is actually a lighter color. I remember that one being a bit more um, syrupy gold, right? This is a very light yellow gold. Cheers. This has uh, some flavor to it. This has some body to it. It still has a very fin uh, bitter finish. So much like the IKEA Lager beer, it has a bitter finish, but I can taste it being more uh, flavorful when it enters my mouth. It, it's still a bit fragrant. It, it's not just beer and bitter. This is pretty, you know, pretty pleasant taste in my mouth. Uh, you yeah, know, let me try that again. Yeah, it's definitely more than just being bitter. It's actually a very pleasant beer to have. Uh, and I think you don't even need to pair this with food. This is going to be one of those, now I know why they call it wife bitter, because it, it goes down really well for a 5% beer. To a certain extent, it's a little bit sweet. So I think that, you know, a Stella, this is a decent lager, a very good lager actually. And I understand why pubs are selling this on tap. This is an excellent purchase, go for it.